All right, well this is Jehu Wine and Liquor. Uh, they are a great little store. They're super friendly. They've always let me shoot here. So um, should be a kind of a quick little video and just kind of see what they got. Um, I do like the way they have things set up here. It, uh, it always spurs great conversations in the chat. So, all right, let's see what they got going on. All right, well, let's check out and see what Jehu has today. All right, let's see. I don't think I have tried any of this. I know a couple people who like that pin hook. Um, I like how things are kind of grouped together here because you can always, uh, they make a lot of sense. So, um, I bet those two are really good together. Got the hole in, which I've got one of those. Um, I don't know. Anybody got any strong opinions on the uh, Wilderness Trail? Right. Uh, local place I have that I go to the cellar has the Jefferson's, uh, I think, Reserve or one of the oceans on one of them. I'm going to definitely get a pour of that. I, I've been really wanting to get a pour and uh, check those out. But I've not got a pour yet. Sorry. All right, you know, and there's the chicken, you know what. And I uh, still got to reach out to buy it, that ex-Bobby, and if he knows about that, since he's a fireman, so. Uh, there's some rum. Oh, that's good. All right, let's see. Uh, sorry, I've got to bend over here. So, look at that. A little bit of buffalo trace down there, sneaking in here. Uh, well, let's check and see what we got over here. Um, all right, we'll start right here. We got... A little bit of Yellowstone. Oh, I don't know why we got to hyper zoom in because I because I touched the screen there. Um, we got some of the uh, Japanese scotches and some cognac in here. Uh, I'm sure they go good together. Um, yeah, good old Basil Hayden keeping using that belt to keep their label on. It's like a man wearing a belt and suspenders. My dad always said, "Don't trust them." Not had any of the company distilling. Um, Created from three weeded bourbons, Tennessee distiller. Anybody had any of that? Got to let me know if it's good or not. Hmm, peach vodka. All right, well, there's not a whole lot more over here, but I will, uh, I did kind of think that that was uh, some old granddad for a second. Peach cookie dough. Ugh. I thought that said uh, bourbon basil, and I was like, oh my goodness. Uh, there is some of the creek water. It's got probably got garbage. I don't know about. I wouldn't say that. I don't know about the juice. Anybody had this juice? I, I love this bottle. It's fantastic. So, and a little bit of the wicked pickle. These look like something you would win at the fair back when you were a kid. And this is not like something you would eat at the fair <laughs> as a kid. Uh, this top shelf is a little bit of uh, maybe tequila. Overflow. So some people in the Discord are going to help me pick out my next bottle. So if there's something on here you think I should get, let me know. Um, I'll go over to the other tequila side as well. Got the big bottles of Canadian Chris' stuff. A lot of rise in Canada. I wonder why that is. A um, little Barry O'Barton. A big bottle of the Old Forester. Got a little bit of the Doers. So I am uh, I'm really interested in the Old Elk. I think... Uh, God, the bottles are just so little for what you get for them sometimes, but I'm going to uh, this Infinity Blend I'm curious about. So, anybody had any of these? Is there an Old Elk I should get? I think there's a cigar blend that I've never seen, so just let me know. Oh, there's a little bit of tequila here off on the side, snuck in here. Um, I know Captain OCD is not going to be happy with this one. Um, I think this is the only place I've seen Pendleton Midnight. I've seen the other Pendleton. That's a big glass bottle there. Some Johnny Walker, some Bushmills, got a little Woodford Reserve. Uh, I don't think there's any dunkers back there. Yep, I don't call out that when I get in trouble. That's a big old thing of the Kraken. Um, those who know me well know that uh, that's my cuss word is Krakatoa um, for various reasons. If you see any of my other videos, you'll know. If not, I'll bring it up again some other time, I'm sure. All right, well, let's go over here and see. Calumet, 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 comment, whatever. Someone needs to find me in real life and in, in, in person and, and tell me exactly how to pronounce that. So, I'm gonna go down. Oh, hear the knees popping and cracking. There's the diplomat, or I'm sorry, diplomatico. 
and the blacken is down here, so that's interesting. And the rattle snap, so I am on the bottom shelf. You gotta go up. Uh, so I need to find out about this Russell's Reserve single barrel here. Uh, I think that's pretty rare for here. And our buddy Pritchard's in there, so um, let's see here. Uh, yep, yeah, I'm gonna see if I find out about the price of that before I go. Right, let's kind of see what we got over here. Got a little bit of high west in the clouds. I don't know why it wanted to zoom in, maybe because I'm too close. I'm not sure what that Devil's River is. It's down there with a dickle. Got a little bit of tequila here. Uh, got some more blacken in the blue note. The real McCoy. Got some Maker's Mark. I'm going to kind of do a wide angle here on these. Let's see, got the Treaty Oak. Got the Smokehead. And the Kentucky Coffee. Got the Barrel Proof, 129. Really, anything above 130 is just about an instant buy for just about everybody, I think. Got all of our Jack up here. Had a Dickel Tabasco. We've got the uh, brown, sugar, brown Sugar Bourbon. That's uh, Jamie Fox's stuff. Right. The Ezra Brooks. The Jim Bean. Peanut Butter Group in here. Love that little dog. Got the Irish Whiskey. There's my dad's juice. Well, uh, when I think about my dad, I think about uh, you guys need to like and subscribe. Um, can uh, if you like these videos uh, when you like and subscribe it really does help and I'll gonna be walking over here um, we uh, have a pretty thriving discord which is fantastic um, growing constantly some big old makers mark and uh, when you are on the discord we can have better conversations in-depth stuff there's a lot of topics there's even a tequila discord which uh, section in there which I think they do more talking than uh, anyone on here 19 crimes. I wonder what 19 crimes they committed. I know uh, tax is probably one of them. So I'm going to do a quick pan through the bourbon. I mean bourbons. <laughs> the keel is over here. Uh, love this bottle. Fantastic topper. So right, two fingers. We've got uh, some of these others. And I'm looking for a reason. Oh, and then the rum. I'm going to have a, I'm going to do a quick pan through the rum as well because I'm going to expand my bar maybe have a maybe even start a rum section in the discord just for conversations for other things um that really the, the tequila part of our thing and i'm not promoting it heavily i know a lot of people don't like tequila really some fantastic conversations in there i'm glad i started that um and it's just it's a growing in popularity and um, you know you can talk about it so all right uh, let's see here i don't see anything that is jumping out at me, but there is some sake down there, which is great. All right, and I'm gonna do a quick pass through the rum. I need some, uh, this pillar was one I was thinking about getting, but someone said you should get it at, like aged like at least 10 years. So uh, you let me know, you tell me, uh, oh, Jen, Ooh. there's a rum that I should get. I do like the Kraken bottle, so. All right, I've got a, one let's see i'm gonna go over here since he ducked out of the way he's got that jack daniels 10 up there um he's got the pendleton um we've got the bargetown and there is a uh looks like a jack daniels 27 up there we've got a little bit of the balabini the old ezra um got the mccallan got the jack daniels and they've got more tequila down through that way so all right well, that's a pretty good haul of everything they've got here Oh look, I, I think uh, they do. They have a little bit of stag here too. Red stag, so. All right, well, uh, like and subscribe if you like these videos. And if you get an opportunity to, come out here and try Jehu. They're in Tennessee. Uh, they're actually in Bartlett. Uh, they're a great uh, little small uh, quick store. Super friendly, super nice. And uh, you can come in and you can uh, help figure out how things are set up or map your way through it. All right, let's have a great day.